A big win for Canada today in a tense trade dispute with the United States. Just before Canada was set to announce how it would retaliate for American tariffs on Canadian aluminum, the U.S. blinked and backed down. Abigail Beeman joins me from Ottawa. Abigail, what happened and what's the reaction? Donna, Deputy Prime Minister Christopher Freeland describes this as a good day for Canada, a day where common sense prevailed. And she and the International Trade Minister stressed over and over this was a unilateral move by the United States. Canada will not be imposing reciprocal countermeasures on the United States. Let me be clear, Canada has not conceded anything. The government is clear they are ready to impose dollar-for-dollar -dollar counter tariffs if the U.S. strikes again. And the Americans haven't taken the trade threat off the table. The statement from the U.S. Trade Representative details that if Canada exceeds a certain quota of aluminum per month before the end of the year, the Americans will impose that 10% tariff retroactively on that month and may reimpose it fully going forward. A Canadian source calls that bluster. We have not agreed to anything. We have not negotiated an agreement with the U.S. on quotas, as your question suggested. What has happened today is that the United States has chosen to unilaterally lift its tariffs on Canadian aluminum exports to the United States. The Deputy Prime Minister wouldn't answer whether Canada is likely to exceed the quota set by the U.S., just stressed the American move was a unilateral one and Canada hasn't negotiated a deal on aluminum. Donna? All right, Abigail Beeman in Ottawa, thank you.